uh, we're at a, another marsh, a different marsh, to target a deeper channel. That's where we think the red's going to be hanging out because temperature wise, we're looking at 41 degrees. And I imagine the temperature in the water is probably going to be about high 40s, low 50s perhaps. And when that happens, from my experience, the redfish, they like the deep channel. So that's the plan. We're targeting redfish. Hopefully we can get a couple flounder, but we're expecting some reds today, boys. Just really quick, uh, quick lesson on how to use a curl tail. Um, it's designed to fish slow because it imitates a crab. Uh, it works best when you're dragging it on the ground because it, it's, it looks like it's scooting in the ground and it has that, uh, that trailer, that, that tail that wiggles and plus that rabbit fur really sways with the current. So there's no need to really uh, work it like a paddle tail per se. Uh, you can, uh, but the best way to fish it is slow fishing it. Um, take your time kind of fan cast especially these uh, opportunistic areas like a drain here uh, especially you got an out, out current so the water's coming out so I imagine if I were a fish I kind of stay like right here on the edge to ambush um, prey or ambush uh, sorry bait fish that's drained out of the marsh all right guys a lot of you have been asking how do I fish the drains with the bugs so as I told you I have an outgoing tide so therefore, the tide's gonna be moving from front to back. So what I like to do is just throw my bugs kind of like at the edge of the drain and let it naturally come back with the current because that's what it's designed for, to hit the ground, let that fur move, the rabbit fur, to make it look realistic. And then I'll slowly give it a couple twitches, reel it in slowly, just kind of let it do, do its thing. And let, uh, just because presentation is very important. If you don't have a good presentation, the fish are not going to bite it. So that's how I like to work the bugs. I hope this helps. Thank you. Oh, there we go. We got something. A little chicken. Nice little chicken. Yeah. Oh, oh man, knocking out. Oh man, no, he's he might be slot the way he's pulling. Ah, uh, just caught him at that little drain. Well, used to be a drain. All right, I'm gonna try to avoid that crab trap there. But no, he I think he's gonna be a, a slot, a lower end slot. All right, yeah, that's a nice fish, man. Nice fish on the curl tail. That's a great looking fish there. Oh yeah, that's a nice looking fish. Very pretty. Very nice. Alright man, let's let's just get a measurement real fast. I'm gonna let you go, brother. I know it's cold out there. Oh, he's a great eating red. 20 and a quarter inch on the money. That is nice. Well, we ain't keeping fish today though. Got plenty in the freezer. Take a quick picture. I'm gonna let you go, brother. Thanks for the fight, my man. Check him out, got him on the crab color uh bugs all right buddy here you go nice fish there he goes all right man first fish calm in the drain uh honestly i thought the fish are going to be more in the middle of the channel which they still might be it's still early but uh i caught a man caught him red-handed at the drain trying to blow up this shrimp i see a little some shrimp popping here and there but it's not as uh significant as last time Oh, there we go. Got something. All right. Did he let go? Oh, yeah, he let go. I think it was a flounder. Right. Felt like a flounder. I think. I don't know if this one's the one that does that. Oh, there we go. Got him. There we go. Finally. <laughs> I felt that thump on the bottom too. He's at the. He was at the bottom. Yeah. That's a nice puller. Oh yeah. He's yeah. Up. Yeah, he's not coming up. Oh man, it's been a grind, man. Really. 
Uh, he might be in the lower end of slot, but I'm not going to be picky. Or actually, no, he's. I don't know, man. No, that's a. That's Is that slide? Just very grateful that I'm able to catch fish in this cold weather, because uh, you tell Mark I've been struggling, man. Uh, <laughs> I caught him on this hoagie bug, bug hoagie, uh, the trout. The, golly, the trout thumper. That's what I get for being lazy, not taking out my measuring board. Trout thumper with the uh, swimming jack trailer and that's a pretty red man he is so pink look at that guys that is such a pretty red yeah yeah look at that blue tail that is this is probably one of the prettiest reds i've ever caught dang that's pretty all right let me just get a quick measurement buddy and i'll get you out of here Oh, all right, all right, all right, hold on, hold on. I swear I can get you out of here. Oh, man, yeah, dude, right on the money at 20. Holy smoke. Check that out. Tails right at the 20. <laughs> that is funny, man. What count is a slot? 20 inches. Look at that, guys. I ain't lying to you, all right? <laughs> Look at that, Mark's hooked up. Looks like we found a nice little spot here. A deep eight foot drop uh, near a drain. So, let's get some pictures and get him out of here. All right guys, check it out. Beautiful pink slot red right on the money at 20 inches. Very grateful to catch this guy, considering how cold it is outside. Thanks, my man. Thank you. It's gonna be a nice big red. Holy smoke! Oh my god! Oh wow! Woo! Check it out, guys! Big old fish! Big old fish! Big old fish! Got him on a drone, too. I can't believe that. Finally. Oh man, dude, it's huge. Dude, big old fish. Look at that. Big old fish. Big old fish. On the drone. That's badass. Alright, let's get him off. Big old fish. All I know is trying to catch a fish and flying a drone is not an easy thing to do. That's how big he is. This is a big guy. Oh man, he's thick. Oh no, oh no, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, buddy. Let me just get a measurement, I'll let you go, I promise. Big dude. Oh, he's so strong. He's like, he's curling up because so. All right, 24 inches, 24 and a quarter. Not too bad. All right, let's let him go. Thank you, my friend, for the fight. All right, ladies and gents, that's gonna be it for today. Really hope you enjoyed the video. It was a grind, but uh, we got the job done. Got a nice limit of reds. Got some nice B-roll. I uh, really enjoyed the 
Texas outdoors, even though we got cold water, cold conditions. And uh, really, really enjoying the top water PDL. Make sure you guys give uh, Old Town some love by hitting that URL link in the description box. And uh, show the channel love too, man. Um, you guys know the drill, man. I'll catch you guys next time.